This is the fifth mission of the seventh battle of TIE Fighter, Treachery at Ortega. Let's get briefed. The Emperor's ship, the Majestic, has been seized, and the Emperor himself abducted by Zarin. Huh. Zarin's flagship, the Glory, waits off in the distance for the shuttle holding the Emperor to arrive. You will lead a group of TIE defenders to locate and disable the craft carrying the Emperor. The fate of the Emperor and the entire Empire is in your hands. How dramatic. The Emperor's ship. Admiral Zarin has committed the ultimate deceit. While feigning support in the battle against Harkov's forces, Zarin is attempting to overthrow the Emperor by abducting him from his Imperial Star Destroyer at Coruscant. You must locate and save the Emperor. Inspect all craft until you find the one that is carrying the Emperor. Then disable the craft so it can be boarded. The loyal Vice Admiral Thrawn will arrive to help in the effort to save the Emperor. Well, we hope he's loyal, because so far it hasn't been working out, has it? You will be flying the TIE Defender designated Alpha-1. Your craft will be armed with 16 advanced concussion missiles. You will be the flight leader and have two wingmen in your group. Lord Vader will oversee the action in his TIE Defender designated Alpha-4. Be sure to follow any of his orders. Once again you will be engaging Imperial craft. Zarin's forces are the most advanced and well equipped of all Imperial Navy craft. Except for mine, of course. <laughs> That's enough for now, sir. The secret order's not here. Let's get moving. Oh, hey. That was easy. You have located the Emperor Alpha-1. Disable the ship now. As you command, Lord Vader. Target disabled. That was easy. Oops. <laughs> Mission critical crap. Sorry, sorry. Vanguard. Huh. Okay. That sucks. Huh, I guess it's just stuck around to the cutscene. Because we've never seen that one before. That's why I hate dogfighting shuttles, they like to ram. Mayday, Mayday! This is the Star 
Star Destroyer Majestic. We have been boarded by Imperial traitors. Alpha One, inspect all the shuttles. Find the Emperor. I wonder if it's variable. No, you have it's located not. the Emperor Alpha One. Disable the ship now. Target disabled. That was easy. They all started shooting at me all of a sudden. I think, the, oh, the shuttles are trying to kill the Corvette. That's what's going on. Imperial class Star Destroyer Vanguard to Alpha 1. This device has been thrown here to hit. Alpha 1, begin boarding operation target destroyed. Alpha One, impressive work. You shall be rewarded. Have we though? Because I could just blow up that Corvette right now. Let's go say hi to Zarin. Target destroyed. Oh, I thought they were all dead already because they weren't showing up on. Why are they ignoring me? What are they doing? What are they doing?
Ah, he's running away. Vader's entering hyperspace, so let's punch it. Apparently we're going a different direction from Vader. Alright, so... We completed our primary goals. No bonus goals, though. Cool. All right. Mission success. He received a medal. So that'll be the end of the campaign. So there weren't any bonus goals. And we didn't lose any fight. We didn't lose any craft. That's hilarious. You have rescued the Emperor and saved the Empire. The mutineer Admiral Zarin was able to escape, though Vice Admiral Thrawn followed his starship into hyperspace. We can only guess at what provoked Zarin to attempt his coup d'etat. Hopefully we can gain some answers when Thrawn tracks him down. For now, Emperor Palpatine and Lord Vader are pleased that Imperial order has been restored. Your efforts and accomplishments in the past battles have been impressive. You have proved to be one of the greatest Imperial Navy Starfighter pilots. Alright, that is enough for now, sir. And that's that! Uh, we will start Battle 8 in the next episode.